The Cavitron 300 Series Ultrasonic Scaling System offers an advanced experience at your fingertips. This innovative unit features a modern touchscreen interface for ease of use, with customizable memory power level presets for improved efficiency. The Steramate 360 rotating handpiece allows for effortless rotation of the ultrasonic insert during a scaling procedure. This handpiece is detachable and autoclavable, reducing cross-contamination for enhanced infection control. On the handpiece connector, you'll find a water lavage control, allowing for easy adjustments without turning away from the patient. The Cavitron 300 Series Ultrasonic Scaling System is designed to rest on a level surface. However, be sure the unit is stable and resting on four feet. The positioning of this unit should allow full access to the AC power cord. Please keep in mind that placing the system in direct sunlight could possibly discolor the plastic housing on the unit. The Cavitron 300 Series has been equipped with a tap-on technology wireless foot pedal, which was factory synchronized to operate with the system's base unit. If your office has more than one Cavitron ultrasonic scaling system with wireless foot pedals, Densply Serona recommends that you mark the foot pedal and base unit for easy reference as to which foot pedal operates with which base unit. To begin, please verify that the main power on-off switch, which is located at the back of your system, is set to the off position before proceeding. To connect the AC power cord, Insert it into the power input on the back of the system and insert the pronged plug into the AC wall outlet. To connect the water supply, insert the blue water line hose into the gray water inlet connector until it is fully seated. Tug gently to ensure the water line is secure. Connect the quick disconnect on the other end of the hose to the dental office water supply or a Cavitron dual select dispensing system. Be sure to inspect all of the connections to make certain there are no leaks. To remove the water line, first, turn the water to the line off, then disconnect the quick disconnect from the dental office water supply. In order to remove the hose from the system, simply push on the outer ring of the system's water inlet and gently pull out the water line. This scaling menu screen is the control panel for the operation of the Cavitron 300 Series ultrasonic scaling system. The touch screen controls will either require a tap of the icon or a press and hold for a full two seconds. The center of the screen contains the power level control. The large number displayed on the slider indicates the percentage of power ranging from five to 100, increasing or decreasing in increments of five when it is slid up or down. The power level can also be selected by touching the scale either above or below the power level number. The rinse icon is tapped to allow use of the handpiece for lavage only, without cavitation of the insert tip. The purge icon is tapped to access the feature which activates continuous water flow through the handpiece without an insert, for 120 seconds, which is the suggested time to purge the water lines at the beginning of the day. The right side of the screen contains three preset power settings that come factory set to 20, 40, and 60. However, these can be reset to any level desired. The settings icon accesses the menu allowing for syncing of the foot pedal to the unit, brightness setting, and the tap-on technology foot pedal control setting. To access the settings menu, press and hold the icon for two seconds. The lock icon is pressed and held for two seconds to lock the screen, disabling adjustment of any parameter until the unlock icon is pressed and held for two seconds. The upper right corner displays the battery level of the foot pedal. All of these features are detailed in the directions for use. To connect the featherweight handpiece cable to the Cavitron 300 Series Ultrasonic Scaling System, 
Insert the black handpiece cable connector into the port on the front of the Cavatron 300 series ultrasonic scaling system. If the cable connector does not seat into the system's port, gently rotate the cable connector until contacts align and then fully insert the connector. To connect the Steramate 360 handpiece, insert the handpiece into the blue connection on the featherweight handpiece cable. If the cable connector does not seat into the handpiece, gently rotate the handpiece until contacts align and then fully insert the handpiece. Once the cord and handpiece are connected, depress the foot pedal until water exits to release any air bubbles that might be trapped inside the handpiece. In order to fully seat the insert, push with a gentle twisting motion. Do not force it. Turn the lavage control on the handpiece to select the desired flow rate during system operation. Flow rate is scaled in increments from one to six. In order to increase flow at the insert tip, turn the control clockwise toward six and turn the control counterclockwise toward one to decrease flow. The flow rate through the handpiece will also determine the temperature of the lavage. Lower water flow rates will produce warmer lavage. Higher flow rates produce cooler lavage. Please note that if you notice the handpiece becomes warm, you should increase the flow rate. The Steramate 360 handpiece provides the clinician the effortless rotation of the ultrasonic insert with their fingertips. This allows adjustable hand positioning, free-flowing movement, and easy access within the anterior and the posterior of the oral cavity. To rotate the ultrasonic insert, place fingers on the nose of the handpiece and rotate to your desired position. To control the ultrasonic power level, simply slide to select your desired power level. Sliding up increases the power, while sliding down decreases the power. A power level may also be selected by tapping the desired position on the power scale. The user can adjust the power level for increased power. Three power preset options are available. Please adjust the power level to your desired output and press and hold the preset button until the sound indicator is heard to reset. The factory setting for the presets are 20, 40, 60. Users will operate this feature during an ultrasonic scaling procedure when lavage is desired with no cavitation. To use, depress and hold the foot pedal for rinse mode cycle. To exit rinse mode, tap the scale button to return to the main screen. This setting is used to flush the water lines at the beginning of the day or between patients. Purge will run automatically for two minutes and adjustments can be made for maximum water flow with a countdown in seconds shown on the screen. Press the scale button to return to the main screen or simply tap the foot pedal. After a two minute countdown, it will then return to the main screen. The Boost feature provides a temporary increase in ultrasonic scaling power for quick removal of tenacious calculus without actually touching the unit. Boost is activated by fully depressing the foot pedal to the second position all the way to the floor. When Boost is activated, the Boost icon will illuminate on the power level display. Boost will remain as long as the clinician has the foot pedal pressed all the way down. In order to deactivate Boost, release the foot pedal to the first position. The Tap-On Wireless Rechargeable Foot Pedal supplied with your system has been factory synchronized with the base unit. Should a replacement foot pedal be necessary, synchronization will be required prior to system operation. Users should maintain a distance of no more than 10 feet, 3 meters, between the base unit and tap-on foot pedal during the synchronization process. To synchronize your foot pedal, begin by turning on the main power switch located at the rear of the system to the on position. The main screen will appear. This is also referred to as the scaling menu screen. Next, turn on the foot pedal by pressing the power button on the bottom of the foot pedal and hold for at least three seconds. A light on the top of the foot pedal will illuminate to verify power. Next, press and hold the settings icon until the settings screen appears. Tap the sync icon on the settings screen. 
followed by pressing the red sync button on the bottom of the foot pedal and hold for at least three seconds. Synchronizing is complete once the sync icon has stopped rotating and sound indication occurs. In order to verify that there is proper communication, tap the scale icon to return to the main screen. Depress the foot pedal to the second position and ensure that boost is activated. With the unit powered on, plug the auxiliary foot pedal cable into the foot pedal and the USB port on the front of the unit. Allow the foot pedal to charge for at least four hours to achieve a full battery charge, which will be visible by the battery charging icon that appears on the screen. The unit will operate with the foot pedal while the battery is charging. This feature eliminates the need to hold down or pump the foot pedal, adding comfort to your routine. Enter the settings screen to enable or disable tap-on. When parentheses are shown around the tap-on icon, tap-on is activated. If there are no parentheses visible, tap-on is deactivated and the icon will be grayed out. With tap-on technology activated, tapping on the foot pedal once will activate ultrasonic power for approximately four minutes. Tapping the foot pedal a second time will disable ultrasonic power and water flow. On the main scaling screen, a tap-on indicator will appear in the power level display while scaling. Please note that tap-on technology only operates when an insert is seated in the handpiece. Cavitron Scaling from Dentsply Serona Innovative solutions for improved comfort and efficiency.